everyone welcome back to my channel gems of knowledge so in this video we are going to study the learning sheet 13 of kalika chetarika from class 9th okay so here they have given about the squares and square roots okay so before learning this topic don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell button to get the notification as soon as i post my new videos okay so here they have given fill in the blanks with an appropriate terms in the following table so you have to fill this table okay so here number is been given and the product so since we are learning here squares and square roots we have to fill this numbers okay from 1 to 10 numbers are given so let us take this numbers so here they have given 1. So product square. When you square this number that is 1 square that will be 1 into 1. You are, you are going to get 1. So similarly here 2 is given. It means here 2 you have to write. So 2 square means 2 into 2 it will be 4. Okay. Similarly 3 that is 3 square means it will be 3 into 3 which is equals to 9. And 4, 4 square which is equals to 4 into 4. 4 4 is 16 we are going to get okay next here they have only written 25 we have to fill this the next number is 5 and 5 square will be equals to 5 into 5 which is equals to 25 similarly 6 6 square that is 6 into 6 6 6 are we are having 36 next 49 they have given that is 7 7 square will be equals to 7 into 7 is 49 next 8 8 square is equals to 8 it's a 64 next is 81 that is 9 9 square that is 9 9 is a 81 and 10 square is given that is 10 into 10 which is equals to 10 10 is a 100 okay next you can see here this is the perfect squares okay and the square root of the perfect square that is this one on the root of 1 will be equals to 1 see here we got the perfect square it means if you square this numbers that is 1 square 1 into 1 is 1 if you square this 2 into 2 2 times you are getting 4 so 3 into 3 you are getting 9 4 into 4 again 16 so similar way you have to find the square root of this numbers now if you if you find the square root of this number you have to get this number as your answer okay so square root of 1 is 1 means the square root of this number is 1 next there is a printing mistake here this must be 4 square root of 4 is nothing but see here you can see you got 4 here the square root of 4 will be equals to 2 so the answer is given 2 similarly next 3 is given it means we have to write the square root of this number that is 9 square root of this number is 3 let me show you how this is possible root 9 okay you can see here root 9 can be written as 3 into 3 okay so that is root and 3 square if you cancel this square and root you are going to get 3 itself so your answer is 3 next is here actually it should be 16 so, so square root of 16 is nothing but 4 because 4 4 is 16 here you can see okay next here 5 is given so here it should be root of 25 this number root of 25 again root of this is 36 actually they have given us 16 so root of 36 is nothing but 6 as you know that 36 can be written as 6 into 6 it means root of 6 square square and root is cancelled you are left with 6 similarly 7 7 means here you should know that 49 see okay because 7 square is nothing but 49 so 49's root is 7 again 64 is given so the root of 64 is nothing but 8 root of 81 is 81 can be written as 9 9's are 81 so here it will be 9 and 10 is given so root of 100 that is 10 into 10 10 square means it will be 100 so this is this is about the squares if after squaring this numbers you are getting this perfect squares and to find the square root if you find the root of this number you are getting this to be as the answers okay so i hope this learning sheet 13 is cleared if you are having any doubts you can comment me down below i'll be back soon with another video that is learning sheet 14 which is based on cubes and cube roots in my next video so till then stay tuned and stay connected don't forget to like share and subscribe thank you